Ever pondered why some women have difficulty walking after sex? It's not just a punchline for a risque joke, but a physiological reality for some. This unsettling mystery has intrigued many, often leading to hushed whispers or awkward giggles. Yet it's far from being a taboo topic. In fact, it's a fascinating exploration into the intricacies of the human body and the mind-boggling science behind our most intimate moments. This phenomenon isn't as rare as you might think. In fact, many women across the globe experience this post-coital difficulty, often leaving them perplexed and curious. It's not a sign of weakness or a cause for embarrassment, but rather a testament to the complex and wonderful workings of the female body. The science behind this phenomenon is both intriguing and enlightening, shedding light on aspects of our biology that often remain unexplored. So let's unravel this mystery, shall we? To understand this phenomenon, one must first understand the female physiology during sexual intercourse. Let's start with hormones. During sex, the body releases a cocktail of hormones. One of them is oxytocin, often referred to as the love hormone. It promotes feelings of affection and intimacy, but it also plays a crucial role in muscle contractions, which are fundamental to the sexual response cycle. Another hormone at play is adrenaline, the fight or flight hormone. It gets pumped into the bloodstream increasing heart rate and blood flow, particularly to the genital area. This rush of adrenaline can cause a temporary state of hyper-awareness, which can make the body feel a bit shaky after the adrenaline rush subsides. Now let's talk about muscle contractions. During an orgasm, a series of rhythmic contractions occur in the pelvic muscles. These contractions can be intense and, in some cases, can lead to a temporary loss of muscle control. This can make it a bit difficult to walk immediately after sex, also, it's worth mentioning the role of the hormone relaxin. This hormone, mainly produced during pregnancy, is also released during sex. Its job is to relax the ligaments in the pelvis, preparing the body for childbirth. But this relaxation can also cause a temporary feeling of instability, contributing to the post-sex stagger. It's all a bit like running a marathon. After intense physical activity, your legs might feel wobbly, and you might find it hard to walk straight. It's the same principle, but instead of a marathon, it's the physiological response to sexual activity, and there's more. The brain plays a significant part, too. During orgasm, the lateral orbital frontal cortex, the part of the brain responsible for self-control, decision-making, and social behavior, temporarily shuts down. This disengagement can create a sense of disorientation, making it a little challenging to walk immediately after. That's quite a lot of action going on inside the body, isn't it? But how does all this cause difficulty in walking? The climax of sexual activity, or orgasm, is a powerful event, especially for women. It's a crescendo of pleasure, a symphony of sensations that culminates in a moment of pure, unadulterated joy. But have you ever wondered why, after this explosive moment, some women find it hard to walk? Well, let's dive into the science behind this intriguing phenomenon. Our bodies are marvelous machines and during sexual activity they work in overdrive. We're talking about a whole series of physiological events that, when pieced together, create the perfect conditions for the post-sex stagger. You see, when a woman reaches orgasm, her body experiences intense muscle contractions, particularly in the pelvic region. These contractions are a key part of the orgasmic experience, intensifying the sensations and contributing to the overall pleasure. However, like any strenuous physical activity, these contractions can lead to temporary muscle fatigue. Imagine running a marathon or lifting heavy weights at the gym. Your muscles are working hard and after a while they get tired. That's what's happening here. The muscles used during orgasm, including those in the legs and lower body, can become fatigued, making it difficult for a woman to walk immediately after sex. Now this isn't a cause for concern, in fact, it's quite the opposite. The post-sex stagger is a sign of an intense and satisfying sexual experience. It's a physical testament to the power of the female orgasm, a reminder of the incredible journey your body just undertook. Remember, every woman's sexual experience is unique. Some might experience this post-sex stagger, while others may not. It's important to listen to your body and understand its responses. After all, knowledge is power, and understanding the science behind our bodies can make our sexual experiences even more fulfilling. So, there you have it. 
The post-sex stagger is nothing more than a sign of an intense and satisfying sexual experience. So we've demystified the post-sex stagger. We've journeyed through the science, understanding the physiological responses that contribute to this phenomenon. Remember, it's a perfectly normal part of female sexual response, nothing to be alarmed about. It's a testament to the power of intimacy and pleasure. The post-sex stagger is not a sign of weakness, but rather a signature of satisfaction. Now, the next time you see a woman walking with a slight stagger, you'll know she's not drunk, just sexually satisfied.